Basketball Championship Tournament Semifinals. We got today's matchup: Texas A&M versus Wayne Canyon University GCU. Texas A&M bringing in the ball. Up to 23 over to nine, uh, over to 10. Great defense by eight. Got a tip off, steal by number one, GCU. Up for the point eight. And it's good, two, or eight for two. That is a great point attempt by number four. We got a fast break, 35 up with the ball. No good. Rebounded by num uh, red eight over to 33 for a fast break. Great, great attempt, and it's good for two. Great help defense by the rest of the team, but it's good for two. Point scored by number one. Four skipped the ball to 33. Great post defense there. Not letting him get through. However, he does score for two. 33. This is a great matchup so far. Only two minutes into the game, uh, but I'm sure we can expect to see this the entire game. Three-point attempt from 33. No good. However, it's rebounded by number eight. Stolen by 10 white. We got a tip off by 34. It's gonna bring it down the court. Slowing it down a little bit. Three point attempt by 33. No good. Pass to 10. No good. Or 40 correction. Get tip ball. It's going to stay red. 33 stepped out of bounds. So we're in a man defense. Great lockdown defense by 40 white. Stolen by one. Bringing it down the court for a fast break. Pass to 10. And it's good for two. And it's 40, uh, 10 for two. For those who have been with us all weekend, uh, this is the NURSA National Basketball Championship. This is the semifinal game here hosted at the University of Wisconsin-Madison at one of our top facilities, uh, the Bakke Recreational uh, Recreation uh, Facility. And we're good for two, number 10. Great back cut by number 10. We got a foul. He's gonna be shooting two. Foul's on number 10. That's his first. First basket's good.
We got a tied game here. Both free throws were good. We got one going into the play. Nothing, nothing good. Hit a fake by 10. Backdoor cut by four. Rebound by four. Put up by four. Yeah, finally taken by 40. White. One going in for the basket. Pass a 10. And it's good for two. The spin move there. Wide open three by eight. Not good. Number eight white for three. For three! We got some energy on the bench for GCU. That always helps the momentum getting into the game. A three point attempt by number 10. Rebounded by one. for two. That was a good drive to the basket. Uh, GCU didn't have really many defenders down there. But. We got a foul on the play. Four, red, with a reach. They're gonna be taking it on the side. Eight rebounding error, inbounding the ball. He's gonna pass to 27. Over to one. He's gonna pass it to 27 for a hoop. There we go, two. We had just under two minutes left. Uh, we got Texas A&M 10, GCU 15. Good spin move by 20, and he got two for it. That's a great move. Three-point attempt from one. No good, but we do have a foul on the play. Rebounding foul. 30 white with a push. Eight with the ball, double team, foul on the play. Number 30. With a push. We got 13 red and 13, 44 red coming in and 25 white. Three seconds left in the quarter. Over to 30. Foul on the play. He's going to be shooting two. We're seeing in other games today. Every three, every free throw attempt matters. 
hope he can put these in. First attempt is good. We have one shot. Best it's good for number 30. Bringing their lead up to five. And that'll end our first quarter. We got GCU in the lead with 17, Texas A&M with 12. For those who aren't here in person, we've got another semifinal game uh, going on against the Air Force and Utah State? NC State, correct, I'm sorry. Uh, it's a great game so far. Officiating our game, we've got Wesley Allen, uh, Fauz, we've got, and we've got Maddie. These three officials are the best of the best. Uh, at this tournament, we've got quite a few officials from across the country, all representing their schools uh, through their officiating skills. Other officials applied through NURSA uh, and were extremely vetted for their skills. All of these officials at today's tournament have experience at other national competitions uh, and regional NURSA events. Most of them officiate high school, college, uh, and lower level basketball. Start off the half, one pass to 25, screen by 27. Up with a three for 25, no good. Rebound by 30, we got a foul on the play. He's gonna be shooting two. This is his second attempt at three free throws. First attempt's good. We get number 40 coming in for 10 white. Second, uh, second attempt is good. Number 13, Texas, bringing up the ball. Over to 44, swing to 33. This is great defense by GCO. Three point attempt is not good. Had some contact on that play, but no foul. Swing to 30. He's gonna drive to the basket over to 25. They're gonna slow it down a little bit. To the basket, one. There was a foul on the play. Foul on red 44. It's gonna be on the ground, no shots. Bounded to 25. You can bring it up to the top of the paint. Great cut by 40. Pass over to 30 with a, another foul. Found 13 red. One's finally being subbed out by number seven. One's had an amazing performance so far. Extremely fast with the ball. Up 
up with a three-point attempt. Not good. However, it's rebounded by 25, and it's good for two. We've got just under seven minutes left of the half. 21 GCU, 12 Texas A&M. 33 up with an attempt. It was hacked a little bit there, but... We have 40. That was a two-point attempt. Number seven, good. Bringing the lead up to 11. Great defense by GCU. That ball was just blocked if you didn't see that. Amazing performance by GCU with their aggressive defense. Really trying to speed up Texas. And it's definitely working. isn't just on the court, but also the bench. Texas A&M chanting defense. Great defense, rebounded by 25. Screen by 40, he's gonna use it. Go to the basket. We're up. No foul, but there was contact. We do have a foul on the play. Foul's on red 25 with a hit. me on the ground. Number four from Texas inbounding the ball. 33 driving to the basket. We've got a jump ball. Great defense by number 40. It's going to stay with Texas. Three swing over to 10. Step back over to 13 with a th with a three. Carson 33 with a three. We have 30 up in the top corner trying to waste some time. Keep that lead before we get into the second half. Great defense by 40. Not letting sev uh, seven get the ball, or get over the ball. Stolen by two, passed to 33 with a two for two. It's a great fast break there. Twenty-five with a two-point attempt. No good. Back cut by ten. Whew. It's a very physical game, as it should be. It is the men's semifinals. We get a blocking foul on number seven. Saying he's straight up. He was straight up, but he did take a step forward into the player. It's a common misconception with players. Uh, they don't necessarily know exactly what a foul is. Uh, just because your hands are straight up does not mean that you can't foul. Ball is being inbounded by number four, Texas. Number eight is going to bring it to the hoop. Rebounded by 33 with a good goal. We got 
19 Texas, 23 GCU. Two-point attempt, jumper, good jumper by 35, bringing up their lead to six. We got it tipped out by 35 white. It's gonna be red ball in the corner. Great cut by 34. Unfortunately, does not make the basket. However, 40 got the rebound, bringing it down by one. Pass to 35 for a wide open three. It's not good. Rebounded by 33. We have a charge on the play. Fouls on number eight with a player control. Also known as a charge in this instance. But yeah, Texas's bench saying he was in the restricted zone. Unbeknownst to them, there is no restricted zone. It's a college NBA rule. We use NFHS rules, which is uh, high school rules. That's why we've got our high school three-point arc. We've got a foul on the play by number 40. He held number eight as he tried to get across. we got 13.2 seconds left in the half. Five seconds left of the half. And he goes up and he's good for two. Long three, uh, long three point attempt, not good. That'll end the half. 21, Texas, 25, GCU. In our finals, we've got our women's GCU and women's, I'm not sure who that other team was, but they, beat Wisconsin, that was a crazy game. South Carolina it is, that was a crazy game. Um, I hope you guys are able to watch that during our, our next game. Uh, we'll be back in just over four minutes to stream the second half.
Awesome. We're back to start the second half. We're going to have GCU start off with the ball. We've got two 10-minute periods left. Score 21, Texas, 25, GCU. We have one bring it down, eight screen across, over to 40. Eight's gonna, ooh, we got contact there, but no foul. It's gonna be GCU's ball. Number one inbounding the ball, over to 35. Cut by 10. Three point it's and it's good. Eight for three. Ten came across for the ball. Got hacked a little bit. Pushed. There we go. And we're good. Basket's good. Ten for two. He's gonna be shooting one extra bonus free throw for that foul. Hopefully bringing the lead down to four. Basket's not good. We got 18 for eight. Number eight, sorry, for an open three. Unsuccessful attempt. Over to one. Eight with the rebound. Four bringing it up. Stolen by 35. Who's bringing it down the floor for a fast break? And it's good. We have 35 for two. We had 10 for an attempt, and it's good, two. Bringing the lead from seven to five. Wide open, jumper from 35, missed attempt. I'm assuming it was tipped. Thirty-four driving to the basket, out of bounds. To me, white ball. We had eight open in the corner. Foul! Woo! That was a crazy foul. He is hacked in four different directions. We're gonna be shooting two. Falls on red 10. We got one more shot from eight. 6.30 left, five point game. Best gets good for eight. Ten going to the basket. Stolen by number one. Going for nope, unsuccessful. Rebounded by ten. Pass back to 10, and he's hacked. We got two shots. We got our other semifinal game, Air Force versus NC State.
They've got four minutes and 11 seconds in the third quarter. Score is 36 26. Not quite sure who's in the lead. That was increased to a, an intentional foul. Ten will be shooting two free throws on his own, and GCU will receive the ball. First attempt is good. He's got one more, uncontested. Second one was not good. We're gonna have GCU ball at half, it should be at half court. Correction is the spot of the foul, so it should be at, uh, it'll be on the floor under the basket. Thirty-five inbounding the ball. Long pass to one. He's gonna cut. Oh, wide open for th three-point attempt. Four three. He had a ten-point point difference there. Thirty-three bringing it up, and he scored two. That was a great up by thirty-three. One for two. Stolen by 27. Gonna pass it all the way across to 30, 35 to get two. We got a timeout, Texas A&M. A much needed timeout. This is their first of the half of the game, actually. Hoping they're talking about uh, good defense because uh, they're going to need it for the rest of the game. Texas uh, is down by a eight, 12, sorry. Algebra just isn't my thing. So we got a minute timeout. Great resting time for GCU. Uh, they've got 10 players, so five on, five off at all times. Uh, but those five on are, they're their starters. They're extremely well, extremely good players, uh, well put together. Um, and, and they need a break as much as everyone else does. We had 2.41 in the third quarter. 39 GCU, 27 Texas a &M. Down the court for 20. Would have been a good opportunity for him to take it. They were, they had the majority of the players on their side on that court. It was out of bounds. It's gonna stay with Texas. We got 13 and 30 coming in for subs to replace four and number eight. Correction, number 10. Number 30 from GCU is replacing 
We had a foul on the play. GCU number 27 holding on the inbound. Let's try it again. Pass up to 30, down to eight. He's gonna attempt to score, and it's good for two! It's been a 10 point difference. Down to 27, up. Foul on the play. Was hoping they'd call that, that was very physical. Falls on red 33. He's got a few, I think. We got two shots. First one's good. We have 40 seconds left in the game. Clock will stop on all whistles the last 30 seconds of the quarter. Basket's good. Yeah, good defense by number one. Over to eight. Jump to 20. Who's going to skip it across the court? Unsuccessful three attempt. But 33 is going to get the rebound and shoot for three. And it's good. Left him wide open there. One got fouled by his own teammate there. Shoved a little, but he'll get over it. We've got a 30 second. Uh, wait time before the start of the next half. We've got Texas AM 32, Grand Canyon, we got 41. It'll be Texas coming in with the ball. Overall, we've had some great defense on both sides. Uh, Texas, very physical. GCU is very, very physical. Uh, always in someone's face, but. We can definitely expect that to continue through in this last quarter. Um, last quarter before a finalist is, is announced. Looking at our game schedule, we've got our women's championship up next at 11.30. Our Special Olympics Unified League uh, at 1 p.m. and our men's championship hosted at 2.30. All these will be played on court eight at the Bakke Recreation and Wellbeing Center at UW-Madison. Picked by one, he's gonna go up for 27. There's a foul on the play. We're gonna be shooting two. Fouls on red 30 he is going to complain about the fouls but that's usual I don't think any player is going to admit that they fouled 27's got two point attempts first one's good we got subs number 10 Texas for 30 Number 33, Texas, signaling to his teammates to speed it up a little bit. Uh, it's going to be needed with that 10 point, point difference, 11 point difference now. Number one, great defense, physical. Uh, there's a foul on the play, number 30, uh, with a hit. Ball's going to be inbounded on the sideline. He's going to skip the pass at number eight. He's going to go in and pass across the court. We got a foul by White, GCU 40, with a block. Number eight in 
on new ball. We got eight minutes left of the, of the game. We had a two-point attempt for 10, and it's good. Bringing the score difference down to nine. Twenty-five for three, and it's good. Twenty-five for three, bringing the score back up to ten, uh, twelve. Skip pass across the court. It was out of bounds. It's going to be GCU's ball. One's gonna take his time bringing it up the floor. No need to rush when you're in the lead, right? Pass the 40. Back cut by 27, and he scores two. Ten with the Euro step. Up for two, unsuccessful. Stolen by 25. Back up the court by one. Back cut by 25 again. Follow on the play. It's going to be a hit. He's going to be shooting two. Falls on 33 with a push. First point attempt is good. We got a sub number two for 20. Texas. Second point is not good. Almost stolen by one. Thirty-three with a three-point attempt. No good. Rebounded by twenty-five. One's got the lane, but he's gonna go for a back cut to thirty. Pass back out to one. Twenty-seven. Thirty. He's gonna go for a jumper. And he makes it. We've got a foul. Is that before or after? Ball's on white 30, uh, 27. The basket is good. I want to see the replay on that. White's going to come in with the pressure. Wants to speed up Texas. Go to 33 with a contested lane. Great fake pass by number eight. Oh! Almost a dunk. That would have brought the energy from a, a level nine to a 40. We do have a sub, 30 for two, Texas. Thirty-four, fifty-one is the score. Ten's gonna go in for the lane, no shot. Thirty's gonna bring up their half-court press. Get a foul on the play. Claims he's straight up, definitely was not. We'll be on the baseline, we're not shooting. Almost picked off by Red, taken by 30. Skip past the 25. Looks like they're gonna be wasting time. We got a foul on the play, number 30. Reached in him there. He does have blood. 
Uh, he will need to be subbed out and then go to athletic training to get that cleaned up. They're definitely going to need him out on the floor. Maybe there is no blood. Oh, yep, right on his shoulder, or his elbow. Strong contested defense on one. Skip pass over to 25 across the court. GCU is wasting their time, followed by 33. We are in bonus, so we will be shooting two. First point attempt is good. We've got three, two subs for GCU. Second point attempt, good. Eight bringing it up the floor. Got a clock issue there. We're gonna reset some time. Two minutes on the clock. Correction, 156 on the clock. Ten for two point attempt. We get a foul number four with a reach. One will be shooting two bonus free throws. First attempt is good. We got one sub, number 10, coming in for 40 white. So for our other game, we've got Air Force versus NC State. Air Force in the lead, 44 32, with two minutes and 35 seconds left. We are in mercy roll on our court, uh, so the clock will not stop. Points good. We got 21 point difference. We had a three point attempt by 33, not good. Number one with the rebound. GCU just fouled, uh, sorry, Texas just fouled, number four with a push. 25 will be shooting two. We have 40 seconds left of the game. First attempt is not good. We got just over 20 seconds left. Can expect GCU to go on to the finals. Second attempt is good. Looks like Texas is just going to waste their time, hold the ball. Uh, this is a good game for GCU. The momentum will propel them forward for the championship game at in a little bit. We got an ending score: 54 GCU 34, or 56 GCU 34. Texas A&M leaving them to go home. Uh, our final game, we can expect some great defense across the board from uh, White, GCU. Uh, number one is going to be their star player there, making sure the ball is always moving and flowing. But thank you guys for uh, watching. Uh, make sure you guys tune in for our next game, our women's championship at 11 30 we've got our men's 
our uh, Unified League Championship at 1 and our Men's Championship at 2.30. See you next time.